We call the meeting to order of the Board of Mayor and Alderman January the 19th, 2016. I'm Bob Kirk. I'll be presiding tonight in the absence of uh, Mayor Holden. Uh, the first thing we need to do is to stand and pledge of allegiance to the American flag. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God. Indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Mr. Jones, let the minutes reflect that all board, all board members are here except uh, Robert Taylor and Mayor Holden. Let's bow our heads for a prayer. Our most gracious Heavenly Father, we thank Thee for this day and for the many blessings which have come our way. We thank you for the opportunity that we have to be of service to the citizens of this community. Dear Lord, be with everybody all over this county and this area of the state as we are predicting bad weather to come in tonight. Please be with those who have been affected by the flooding and those who have been affected by personal losses of loved ones and those who may be ill and in the hospital or at home recovering. Now be with us tonight as we deliberate the decisions that affect all the citizens of this community. For we ask these things in your name and for your sake. Amen. 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 Uh, approval of minutes, last meeting. I hear a motion, approval of minutes. So moved. Uh, motion by Cheney, second? Second. Second by Moody. All in favor say aye. Aye. Opposed like say, and motion carries. Unfinished business. Is there any unfinished business from a uh, previous meeting? Hearing none, we'll move on to the new business. The first, the first item on the agenda tonight is a public hearing for uh, a couple of beer permits. Uh, Chief Isbell. Yes, sir. Thank you. Which one would you like to do first? you have a preference? Uh, the Q mark. A background investigation has been completed for the property of Qmart 1325 East Court Street. This uh, location has changed uh, management, uh, so therefore a, a, an application process had to, we had to go do a background investigation uh, for off-premise beer permit, and I see no reason to deny uh, the applicant a beer permit. Uh, there has been a permit at this location previously, is that correct? Yes, sir. Okay. This is a public hearing. Do I have uh, anyone in the audience that would like to make a statement for or against uh, this uh, beer permit? Hearing none, I'd entertain a motion to uh, grant a beer permit for Q Mark Nyersburg, Inc., 1325 East Court Street. So moved. Um, motion by Morgan. Do I hear a second? Second. Second by Cheney. Any further discussion? All in favor say aye. Aye. Opposed like sign. Motion carries. The second permit, uh, Chief Isabel. The second permit is actually for an on-premise consumption um, at the location of 2695 Lake Road. Uh, the name of the business will be called Pub 78. This is the former touchdown club that also had uh, a beer permit for consumption. Uh, background investigation was completed uh, and see no reason to deny the applicant uh, this, this permit. This is a public hearing. Do I hear comments for or against uh, uh, this beer permit for Pub 78 on uh, Lake Road? Hearing none, I entertain a motion to approve. So moved. So, uh, motion by Maid Carolyn Norman. Second? Second? Second. Second by Cheney. Any further discussion? All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed like sign. Motion carries. Thank you, Chief. Yes, sir. Next item on the agenda is a resolution. Uh, Bob, you want to present this uh, resolution for us, please? This resolution is um, uh, a very um, Prescribed format by the state of Tennessee. It's involving the community development block grant. That's what the CDBG uh, acronym stands for. 
Uh, we've been receiving these grants for a number of years now. We're currently involved in one. As we get ready to move forward and apply for a 2016 grant, uh, we're asked to uh, uh, perform a resolution by this board uh, authorizing the city to, uh, to move forward with that process when it does come to us. And that would be specifically for uh, performing eligible community activities for the benefit of the majority of the residences in Dyer Dyersburg, Tennessee. Specifically, sewer system improvement projects not to exceed $500,000. And then I think you have a copy of the resolution and I gave uh, Alderman Kirk. Uh, basically, uh, you might want to read, Mr. Kirk, what this, uh, these expenditures are for. Okay. The expenditures are the funds to replace a bar screen at the main pump station and micro screens at the wastewater treatment plant. Also, wear replacements and the number three a clarifier. And Bob, uh, is this a matching grant? Mr. Kirk, I, I can't really answer that question right now because these, these grants change from time to time as far as the amount of matching money. Uh, maybe Mr. Anderson might be able to address that better than I. You don't know what our participation might have to be then? Sometimes it's 25, sometimes it's 10, sometimes it's <laughs> even more than that. It, usually it's less than, it's, it's somewhere around 10%. Yeah, okay. It, it, it's, it's a good investment for the money spent. Uh, thank you. Yes, sir. Do I hear a motion uh, that uh, this board pass this uh, resolution, uh, number 01192016 CB, CDBG grant? Hear a motion? So moved. So moved by uh, Moody. Do I hear a second? Second. Second. Second by Terry. Any further discussion? All in favor say aye. Aye. Opposed like sign. <coughs> Motion carries. Uh, the next item on the agenda is the uh, Finance Committee meeting of January the 13th. Chairman Kevin Cheney. The Finance Committee met at 4 p.m. on Wednesday, January 13th, 2016 in the City Hall second floor conference room. Committee members present, Mayor John Holden, Kevin Cheney, Alderman Terry Glover, and Bob Kirk. Other attendees, Alderman Mike Morgan, Bill Eskew, Alderwoman Carolyn Norman, Steve Anderson, Treasurer, Ken Jones, State Gazette Reporter, Greg Williams, Purchasing Agent, Scott Ball, Stormwater Department, Steve Isabel, Dyersburg Police Chief. Chairman Cheney opened the meeting with discussion to determine the future direction and operation of the Dyersburg Municipal Golf Course. In discussion, the following was noted. Steve Anderson provided a summary of golf course revenues and expenditures. Greg Williams discussed the golf course lease agreement from another neighboring city in West Tennessee. Committee agreement to consider seeking requests for proposals to lease operations of the golf course on a long-term basis. Chairman Cheney <laughs> called for a motion to properly advertise RFPs for the golf course long-term lease. Alderman Bob Kirk motion for the approval for the RFPs with a second by Alderman Terry Glover. It was noted that any lease should provide the city to end the <coughs> lease agreement within 30 days and there should be no third party lease options in the contract agreement. The motion was approved. Mr. Williams stated that he could start the RFP process immediately, recognizing that time was critical for continued course maintenance and preparation for the spring 2016. With no other business before the committee, the meeting adjourned at 4.15 p.m. You've heard the minutes of the meeting of the Finance Committee uh, of January the 13th. Uh, do I hear any discussion about the meeting or do I hear a motion that we approve uh, the minutes of this particular meeting? Some hear a motion? Motion by Mike Morgan. Do I hear a second? Second. Second by Kevin Cheney. Any further discussion? All in favor say aye. Aye. Opposed like sign. Motion carries. Next item on the agenda is a report from Alderman. Uh, Alderman Eskew? I don't have anything. Terry Glover? No report. Kevin Cheney? I don't have anything, thank you. Mike? No. Dennis? Just remind everyone to 
keep an eye on their neighbors the next few days because we got a lot of cold weather and some bad weather supposedly coming in even this weekend. But other than that, that's all I have. Okay. Ms. Carroll? Everything's fine. One report from the mayor's office that uh, was handed uh, uh, that we have a letter from the state of Tennessee controller of the Treasury in relationship to uh, the work that's being done with our pension program. And uh, is, this letter states uh, from Justin Wilson, the Comptroller of the Treasury, that everything is in order, as I understand it, uh, Mr. Jones, uh, and has been approved by the funding board uh, for the changes and the new look of the pension program for the city employees. Is that correct? Yes, sir. Okay, and we have a copy of that if anybody's interested in it. Uh, up here tonight, but uh, we have been approved by the Comptroller of the uh, Treasury. Does anybody else have anything that should come before this board? Mr. Kirk, I did yes. forget something. All right, go ahead. Uh, a couple of times after meetings that I've been approached by citizens the next day saying they either couldn't hear us or couldn't see us or whatever, so I had a guy text me just now and said that he could hear it and it was loud, but it was really dark. He couldn't see anybody up here. I didn't know if anybody, I mean, see where we at on that or what well, we can do or whatever. But We've had problems with this uh, system for a number of years now, and uh, we've discussed ways that we could make improvements, either to uh, make, make it where people could see it and hear it, or else <laughs> do away with it. And we have not made that decision yet, I don't think, but. Uh, Kevin's back there working on it tonight, and I hope that uh, we would make uh, those provisions that need to be made in order for the public to be better informed of what goes on at these meetings. And uh, we'll certainly continue to pursue that, and I'll pass that along to the mayor. He, he said it's good and it's loud. He said, but it's really dark. Well, it's loud because I'm here. I know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we'll work on it, Mike. Anything else uh, come before this meeting tonight? If not, I will stand adjourned and tell Mayor Holden we did a good job tonight. Okay, thank you. <laughs>